what's up guys, it's Enzo here, and I'm back playing Final Fantasy XII, the Zodiac Age. I have my party here. As you can see, they all have their second job classes. Not really sure how effective or uh, how good or great my job class party setup is, but uh, I guess we'll see through time. I'll have uh, the party go forward with the, uh, the story and trigger a series of FMVs and cutscenes. Such a tremendous honor to again be graced with your presence, Majesty. You left us with such great dispatch upon our last encounter that I must confess I had begun to worry that we may have given your Majesty some cause for offense. Such a heartfelt display of remorse. Now what is it you want? I want you to give me the Nethersite. The Nethersite? That is a base imitation. We seek Wraithwald's legacy, the ancient relics of the Dynast King. They affected Nethersite. Did you not tell them, Captain Azalus? <sighs> Majesty, he speaks of the Dawn Shard. That is the Nethersite. <sighs> are you mad, Vosla? If we are to save Dalmasco, we must accept the truth. I will fight this profitless battle no more. <sighs> Captain Azalus has struck a wise bargain. In return for the Dawn Shard, the Empire will permit Lady Ash to reclaim her throne, and the Kingdom of Dalmasco will be restored. Think on it. An entire kingdom for a stone, you must admit, is more than a fair exchange. And when all is said and done, your master will have another pet. Lady Ash, let us take him for the people of Dalmasca. Your Majesty wallows in indecision on peril of their heads. And his shall be the first to fall. Well, at least your sword is to the point. To think the relics of the Dynast King were deaffected Nethysite, Dr. Sid will be beside himself. What did you say? Captain Azalus, take them to Shiva. They should have leave to return to Ravanasta soon. I want you to assess its power. Did our orders not specify that we return the stone for testing? I will not chance returning with a stone that is yet unproven. When we return to Dalmasca, we can announce that you are alive and well. I will then continue our negotiations with the Empire. I believe Lars is the key. 
He'll listen to us. We should trust him. Who are you, Vossler, to talk of trust? The son of Dalmasca. Equipment here is limited, so we'll be using the ship's drive to make our assessment. Once we've connected the stone, the reaction should be easily measured. Methods do not interest me, only results. <sighs> Friend? Such heat! The mist, it's burning! <gasps> 6,800, 6,900, 7,000! This must be Dare Factor Nethersite! The Count still climbs! Ah, we found it at last. True day affected Nethersite. The power of the Dynast King in my hands. <laughs> Blood alone does not an Emperor make, vain. What is this? Something's wrong. What is it? <laughs> you stand! <laughs> Hold her down! What's wrong with her? I always knew Fran didn't take well to being tied up. Ooh. I just never knew how much. How about you? I like Fran's idea. Let's get out of here. No farther! Sky Pirates, the future of Dalmasca will not be stolen. <sighs> Why do this, Bash? This struggle is futile. You must know where it leads. I do know. All too well. Okay, so this is a boss fight. We're gonna have to beat Vosla. Ooh, great. What sword can we use? Bone hearing. Yeah, I just want freaking. I want Bosch here to go hand in hand combat against freaking Bossler. Let me steal something first from him. Ooh, a black belt. Nice. Dark. Hey, you guys got this. Engine power falling rapidly. Each negative, impossible. Engine we cannot run to the bridge. Report. What are they doing down there? What's happened? The other side's draining the ship's power. Disengage it at once. I want that. Not three units. They're near it. Damage critical in 300. Cascade failure. Ash, let's go. All I have done. I've ever thought of Delmasca first. I know you do. I would ne'er gainsay your loyalty. Look on what my haste has wrought. Did I act too quick? Or was your return too late? I can serve her no more. You must take up my charge.
this one. Get the little dicey. The mist. It manifests now. Is that what you call this? The dreadnought Leviathan is sunk. The Eighth Fleet of the Arcadian Imperial Army lost. As word of the events in the yacht sounded throughout the Empire, quit I, Bujerba, citing sudden malady, my true motive, to bring the various counter-imperial forces scattered throughout Ivalice together in unified resistance. By this time, Lady Ash had made her return to Rabanaster. She had not, however, made known her presence. Rather, she was content with keeping both her own whereabouts and those of the Don Shard concealed. Had she chosen then to go before her people, my error in announcing her suicide would be known, to the great detriment of my efforts to assemble a resistance. In such circumstance as the Lady Ash then found herself, even were she to proclaim Dalmasca restored, it would serve only to invite the Empire's wrath. Though Arcadia had lost her Eighth Fleet, she remained, as ever, a military power with which to be reckoned. Empire assembles a vast host under guise of martial exercises. It is our belief they wait for the proper pretext, the sooner to make their strike against Arcadia. The loss of Leviathan and her fleet at such a time comes as a most grievous blow. Were Azaria to invade, the battle would be hard fought. Had Lord Vane not deployed the fleet so capriciously, we would not now find ourselves in such perilous circumstance. Lord Vane shall be made to answer for his actions. It is the will of the Senate. Excellency, though he be your son, justice must be served. A convenient thing, justice. And so I must now make a choice between my throne and my son. A most lamentable situation for us all. Oh? For Lord Vane, perhaps. Yet surely Lord Lausa will make for a fine emperor. Lausa so adores his brother, and he is yet young. But he will not remain young forever. Already he busies himself unraveling Lord Vane's tangled skein. Lord Larsa has found his role to play and pursues it with some enthusiasm. Ah, yes. And who would set him at such tasks? What matter? Lord Vane himself once saw his elder brothers brought to like justice, did he not? At your Excellency's behest, as I recall. <coughs> you may put yourself at ease, Lord Gramis. 
So long as the Senate watches over her, Arcadia's well-being will ever be ensured. By your will, I shall bid Vain return to Arcades. So, it was the Dawn Shard that brought down the Imperial fleet. You know your stuff. Destructive power of such force. I've seen it once before. Lady Ash, you know of what I speak. Nabudis. The capital of Old Nebradia, Lord Rassler's fatherland. At the time of the invasion, a division of Imperials entered the city. There was a mighty explosion. Friend and foe died alike. Something was there. One of the Dynast King's relics. The Midlight Shard was in Nebradia. More Nethocide. Well, no wonder they invaded. That ridiculous war. The trap at the treaty signing. All this because Vane wanted power. He must not be allowed to claim the Nethocide. The Empire must never hold it. Oh, they already do. The Dusk Shard, most likely the Midlight Shard, too. Besides, can't they manufacture Nethersite now? Very well. Then the path set before us is clear. We'll use the Dawn Shard to fight them. Dalmasca does not forget kindness, nor ill deed done. With sword in hand, she aids her allies. Sword in hand, she lays to rest her foes. This Nethersite, I hold, must be my sword. I will avenge those who have died, and the Empire will know remorse. You even know how to use it? I... <laughs> the Gareth may know. The Gareth people live by the old ways. Matricide lore is a part of their culture. They may hear it, the cry of the Nethersite's power, whispers of the stone's menace. Dangerous though it be, what we need now is power. Should we declare Dalmasca free without the means to defend our claim, the Empire would crush us. You must take me to meet with the Gareth. They live beyond Osman Plain. Not exactly close. Compensation, is that what you want? Straight to the point, aren't we? I like that. Compensation. How about the ring? This? Isn't there something else? No one's forcing you. I'll give it back to you, as soon as I find something more valuable. What do you mean, something more valuable? Hard to say. I'll know when I find it. 
What is it you want, Vaughn? What are you looking for? Me? What am I looking for? I... I guess... Well, I, uh... You know... LOL. Well. Hey. Is there more FMVs and stuff? I have a feeling there's more. <sighs> right. The Gareth are said to dwell in Kirwan. So they do. We'll need to head south, past the Giza Plains. It is the rains now in Giza. The Wadis will be swollen with the deluge. Passage may be difficult. But those same waters may also lay open new routes to us. Regardless, we must go south, yes? First things first. You're eager to be on your way, I know. But we should see that we're prepared before setting out. I made my resolve two years ago. I swore to overcome any hardship I may face. Man cannot live by resolve alone, Princess. Alrighty. Finally. That was a long set of Freaking FMBs and uh, yeah, the, who's this big oaf here bumping into me. Anyway, uh, we're back in Rabanaster here and uh, yeah. Alrighty. So since we're back in Rabanaster, let's work, make our way to this. Kitten side quest or Kitten side quest over here. This, uh, yeah, this NPC here, the Viera. Hello, how have you, have you come for another visit? Little has changed for me. I have seen much of the uh, city, though I still have made few friends, and I'm no longer closer to, uh, no closer to realizing my goal. I have not spoken of this to you before, but I came to Rabanas to become more like my sister. She had grown tired of our life of isolation. Long ago she left. Only later did I hear rumors she had come here. All this time my sister has been making her way through the world while I lived in sheltered peace of the wood. I would be as she is. Do you think it is possible? So, uh, the right answer to go for, for the best reward, would be this one. It'll never happen. Harsh, but we gotta choose that one. I see. So you think me too naive to follow in my sister's footsteps. Though you may speak the truth, I am not yet beaten. Alrighty. Cool. So... That's uh, that's all for for now. What we can do with her? Oh, yeah. Let's go to the clan Centurio, where we get the the elite marks and stuff. So, I don't think this is going to be a long video, guys. The FMVs and stuff pretty much ate all of my, uh, my video time. How fair is the hunt? You're a rear guard already? You've been burning the midnight oil. Fancy Kuryu knows how to treat his hardworking members. Here's a reward for your accomplishments. Three remedies and two... TP stones. Alrighty, I need remedies. Keep up the splendid work. You're a vanguard already? Oh, I guess I've been leveled up. I've leveled up more. Another reward. Three high potions and two TP stones. You've defeated the demon wall. Impressive. 
the Society of Antiquity sends you this. So they have gratitude for laying open of new avenues of research into the past. 1,200 Yale and a nugget of Electro. Another demon wall. Impressive. Cool. 600 Gale and a Warp Hope. You now command an Esper. Impressive. Sends you this with his uh, compliments. Alright. Two Arcane and two TP Stones. So we can get this one, this Gale, this Snapper. This uh, elite mark, a degenerate tortoise that can once menace that once menace ease the flames and has returned, and it may be my fault. Let's go speak with the petitioner. They can be found in the Giza plains over there in that map. Someone named Nanao. Alrighty. Good luck hunting your mark. Each time you make, uh, each kill you make wins greater renown within the guild. Going to ask about the guild snapper, are you? You've got some drive in you, boy. Could you learn a thing? I could learn a thing too from you. Sticking on my tail so long, it's it's like the it's like the sprout roots. Maybe it's time I went on hunt myself. Okay. Guess that guy's uh will join us or something later. Cool. Let's go look at what other hunts we can get, like from the sand sea. Alrighty. So, uh, let's see what other hunts we can get here in the sand sea. I know I should also drop by and check the, um, the, the stores, like the, the magic shop, the armors, and the weapons shop. But I'll do that uh, on my own accord. While I'm not recording, because uh, that takes some time and deliberation on my part. Ooh, a bunch of hunts. White boots. I'm in something of a fix. A monster is made off with an item of great importance. I seek aid of a hunter to win it back. Petitioner is Sorbet over in the uh the western sand area of uh Ramanaster. okay this one ringworm <laughs> ringworm i have to make a request to frequent <laughs> sorry for uh being bad at reading guys i have to make frequent trips through the western sand last time i met more than my match. I need a hunter to clear the way. <laughs> that name is funny. Ba Balzac. Okay. Let's go uh, talk to that petitioner. Marilith. A friend wishes to make an exceptional toast, so I want to send him an ex exceptional serpent wine. You... Can you get to slay this exceptional serpent? Sure. Oh, they're here inside the uh, the sand sea. The tavern master. Enclados. There's a creature in Osmond Plain. Kill it. This is how one summons a hunter. Is it not good? I will be waiting. 
someone in Osmond Lane. So this is uh, someone in the, the Giza Crocodile. Alright, what is this? Wivering Lord. Oh, so it's complete. I guess I just need to speak to the petitioner. The... Yeah. Alrighty, I accepted all of them. Those are all the hunts. I think one of the petitioners here is this one, Tavern Master. Come out the bill, have you? But you know I'm in need of an ingredient most rare. Naturally, a mark is involved, or I wouldn't be in need of a hunter. I received an order for a fine serpent wine, a gift to thank someone for rescuing a person of importance or some such. But I lack the ingredients, yada yada. Except the Marilith. Uh, it's in the Zartinan Caverns from the Western Sand. You can find the Marilith that said I searched high and low with no luck. Alright. Cool, cool. <clears throat> so, let's go to the... To claim our reward for the... Wyvern Lord hunt? Yeah. I think the... A reward is somewhere, I think, in the the weapons. If I'm not mistaken, the weapon shop or the armors. Okay, so we're here in the, um, the weapon shop. Slain the Wyvern Lord, have you? You've done Rabanessa a great service. After you'd set out, I thought I might have been re overreacting just a touch after all, but then there's not to be gained from doubting now, is there? You've done a man's job. Here's your bounty. Take it with my thanks. Elfin bow. Ooh. I don't think I have that bow. Sounds like something nice for the uh, Nello to be uh, parallel arrows. Did you have that before? But yeah, cool. Nice reward there. Just checking the primer. So a lot of hunts to be done, and a lot of side quests too. So I'm gonna leave the side quests for my next video. I'll do that. So there's a bunch of them. I'll try to cover all of them. And yeah, thank you for watching this video, guys. Mostly just to progress the story, but I appreciate you for watching all the way through. I'll see you in my next video, alright? And uh, peace out. Bye-bye. <laughs>